I joined the Navy out of the Naval Academy. I went to Annapolis for college and um, actually was a nuclear submarine officer for seven years um, before I went into Navy medicine. I chose operational medicine um, because of the uh, lack of a standard um, expected path. The, there's a lot of diversity and uh, dynamic change involved with operational medicine. Of course, uh, you're doing a lot of things, a little bit of a lot of things. Uh, you, you do uh, some primary care, you're addressing when people don't feel well, um, you have to do a little bit of infectious disease. Sometimes there's an outbreak of uh, even, you know, flu. But of course, you know, we had the pandemic recently and, and operational physicians are trying to solve that problem on a Navy ship, for example. When you have lots and lots of people who can't socially distance, how do we keep doing the mission when everyone's together? Pretty unique. I, I'm not sure that there is a, a civilian equivalent to that. Um, certainly different aspects of the job have have equivalencies, but in total, um, I think operational medicine is unique in, in the entire world. It's, it's a really amazing opportunity.